Captain, Civil Engineer Corps, United States Navy, departing. Captain Kevin Bartow relieved Captain Michelle LaDuca as NAVFAC Far East Commanding Officer and Regional Engineer for Commander Navy Region Japan, Commander U.S. Naval Forces Korea, and Singapore Area Coordinator during a change of command ceremony on board Fleet Activities Yokosuka, July 31st. This, this period, this two year period, uh, marked with tremendous challenges. Uh, perhaps more so than other times. Personnel vacancies, very complex projects, natural disasters, and through it all, NAFAC Far East has had an incredible record of on time, high quality execution. Safety's been at the forefront of all your actions and activities, and no NAFAC command has a better safety program over the long term than this organization. I cannot believe that two years have gone by so quickly. It has been a tremendously challenging and rewarding tour, and I'd like to highlight just a few examples of the many great things we have done. Uh, one of them, we, we celebrated our 10-year anniversary as a Facilities Engineering Command, 10 years of exceptional public works, utilities, transportation, and engineering services provided to a changing and growing cadre of diverse and important supporting commanders. Also during these last two years, we, and I really mean you, uh, have earned numerous awards, including CNO Safety Awards, uh, Awards for Cultural Resource Management at PW Yokosuka, SECNAV Awards for Energy and Water Management at both the blue and gold levels of achievement. We have a NAFAC Pacific's Team of the Year and a Supervisor of the Year at Atsugi, uh, an Admiral Ben Morrill Leadership Award winner at PWD Sasebo, a NAFAC Sailor of the Year for 2014. The list goes on and on, and it reflects the across-the-board talent of this organization. Uh, during this time, you have amazed the world with the speed and effectiveness with which you've responded to contingencies and maintained or restored mission capabilities due to record snowfall and power outages in the Kanto Plain, record rainfall and flooding in Chinhei, Korea, and Misawa, weather and infrastructure outages in Diego Garcia, seemingly endless typhoon recovery in Okinawa. And of course, the world-class response and support for the pivot to the Pacific and other major movements, including peer capability and capacity improvements in Japan and Singapore, DIPRI and the relocation of the wing from Mitsugi to Iwakuni, the arrival of the LCS and the AOR, host station relocation programs in Japan, Singapore, and Korea, implementation of facilities initiatives, including UICAP, cyber security, energy, and of course, overseas drinking water. During the ceremony, NAFAC Pacific Commander Rear Admiral Brett Meilenberg presented Captain LaDuca with the Legion of Merit, Gold Star in lieu of second award. For service is set forth in the following citation. For exceptionally meritorious conduct in the performance of outstanding service as commanding officer, Naval Facilities Engineering Command Far East from July 2013 to July 2015. Our primary job as facility professionals is to support the fleet and ensure the mission, the region's installations are ready to meet the mission requirements of our sea, land, and air forces. NAFAC is a service organization delivering professional facilities engineering services across our area of operation. We are an organization of people, not of machines. We need the people to make our facilities engineering and services mission successful. Captain Bartow will lead approximately 2,000 military, U.S. civilian service and host nation employees in Japan, Korea, Singapore, and Diego Garcia. NAFAC Far East delivers more than $700 million annually in facilities management, public works, and construction contracting services.